Objective number five says be able to calculate the concentration of a solution three different ways. So these three formulas are on your helping hand. You'll get a clean helping hand tomorrow. You get a periodic table. But percent by mass, percent by volume, percents are all the same. It's always the part over the whole times 100%. And the molarity, which is going to be your moles per liter, moles of solute per liter of either solvent or solution. They kind of use solvent and solution interchangeable. So if we look at a couple examples here, 50 milliliters of acetone is mixed with 450 milliliters of water. What's the percent by volume? So if you're doing a percent by anything, it's part over whole. So my part is 50 milliliters. Is 450 my whole, or do I have to add the 50 to it? What's your clue if you have to add it or not? Yeah, it says it's mixed with 450 milliliters of water. I'm telling you that the acetone's the solute, the water's the solvent. If I said 50 milliliters of acetone is part of a 450 milliliter solution, then I've told you I've already mixed them, but you need to read it and decide if they've been mixed yet or not. So it's going to be divided by the 450 plus the 50 for the whole. Times 100%. What is that, 10%? Some tricky math. Okay, so the second one says how much sucrose is dissolved in 800 milliliters of solution if it's a 12.5% sucrose solution. So I'm really using the same equation here. Part over whole times 100%. And that's going to equal my percent by volume. Oh, come on. So if I plug in what I was just told and I leave an X for what I'm being asked, I'm being asked how much sucrose. So I'm being asked for the part. And I'm being told the whole is 800 milliliters of solution times 100%, and that should equal 12.5%. So if I go ahead and rearrange this to solve for x, x is going to be equal to 12.5%. Times the 800 milliliters divided by the 100%. Or some of you know you could just take the 0.125 times 800. That's because you're rearranging the equation. Either way, you're doing the same thing. And you should come up with the same value, that x equals, what is that, like maybe 50, 12.5? That's close, 100.